Show you the inside of my other box Chevy that I just got yesterday. Just got it yesterday. It's running. It's not like I need a little exhaust leak, a little tune up, you know. I'm gonna check for a spin real quick though. I ain't put my seatbelt on. This is my first time driving it. See, it's the exhaust leak sound like. Light on. Give it a spin in the hood. Trans seem like it's switching. On time. It's that infinity I did. I don't know if you guys can see that's the infinity I did the bump on. Get it up a little bit. Let's ride. Feel a little drag in the transmission. Might need some fluid. I haven't checked nine of the fluids. First time he driving it. Let's see, I'm in a. You know, I'm run to the gas station real quick. Let y'all see how I look on the outside. <clears throat> Sound like it might need a starter too. It might need a starter. Might need a starter. See the outside look. My seat belt. Seat's pretty clean, but you got a couple burn spots here and there. Door panel handles missing. Power everything. Got a little rust on it. No nothing major for the boy. You know it's nothing major. A little rust. We got a little exhaust leak. Got the chrome piece. What up with the bro? I know where a fender at. I don't know if I'm gonna fix that and pull this bump out. There's my other toy, man. Don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet. Might be for sale. In the office, let me know. Driving it, man. I've been driving it for a minute. Wait on this damn train. I said it's a decent little box, Chevy. You know what I'm saying? I'm just might just sell it. I might just sell it. If I don't sell it, I'm gonna use it for an everyday rider. This just broke while I was driving. Hit a bump. That boy came right up out of there. But you know, like I said, I'm gonna enter the train down there. Waiting for this damn train. Been sitting up here for a minute. It's not overheating. Like I said, it need a tuner, like I said, it needs some little work here and there, you know. Yeah, it needs some floor, this floor is ate up, but you know, everything that's wrong with it is not a problem for MB to fix, so, you know, I'm just, you know, if I put that sunroof in there, because I got an extra sunroof, I was going to prime it up and just sell it as is, you know. Or like I said, I might just keep it for everyday drive, I don't know, man, just prime it up. <clears throat> Keep it factory. I don't know. You know, I don't do factory. <coughs> That's why it's called MB Customs. It's <coughs> <coughs> the longest I ever had a cold, man. I ain't never had a cold this long. But I, YouTube, uh, catch y'all guys on next. About to go see my little bro real quick. They throwing a party tonight. It's like 8 o'clock in the morning right now, though. But I'm gonna go holler at him real quick. Go, uh, I gotta show y'all this amp he just got, man, that we finna put in this bubble. Now, we trying to get them cars together right now, you know. So, he bought this, uh, some of his pieces. I'll be showing you guys that in a minute. <clears throat> so, all right, with that being said, you two, catch you guys on the next one, man. Let me go and get past this train for another one coming. That's how it is on the south side, man. And the hundreds, them trains be coming back to back. For real, for real, so. Alright, so shit, I'm gonna holler at y'all on the next one, man. Peace and love.
Going with the bass processing. We're going with two EQs. Now, I know y'all might say, why we going with two EQs? We just be going with two EQs to split them in half. One for sub and one for highs only. So, some guys might understand it, some guys might not, but it's old school stuff, you know what I'm saying? It's crossover too. You know? Some people might understand it, some people might not, but when y'all when y'all hear it, as it's all said and done, you're gonna be like, okay, that's why they did that, you know. Everybody got their own little techniques, how they hook up sounds, you know. That's one thing I like about installs, you know. As long as the wiring right, everything ain't if it don't burn up, if it sound if it overheat, you know you got it wrong. If anything overheat, you know. You know, I was told a system should not overheat. If it overheat something is overloaded. You know, I'm not trying to debate with anybody. I don't like to debate about sound and music because it's all opinion anyway at the end of the day. You know, we just showing y'all what we doing. No competition, none of that. We just, you know, doing us. So our right, YouTube, we're going to show y'all the new custom box. We're going to be working on the door panels. A lot of work, a lot of work you guys going to see. We're going to get it together this year. Feeling a little bit better now, so, you know. Take advantage while I'm feeling good. I can be late when this weather change, so I can get back to it. All right, catch y'all on the next one.